Tourer team, and welcome back to Frostpunk on PS5. And you picked me up uh, again exactly where I left off. Um, one thing about this game is time moves fast. Uh, time moves fast. Things change quickly, I think is what I mean. So I, I don't really do a lot off camera because I'm worried that once I start, like things will change and you'll miss it. And you go, ah, wait, what did you do? Why did you do that? Why did you do this? Um, so anyway, so here we are. Um, and I've been putting a bit of thinking into um, our our various needs. Um, so let's talk about those. Uh, firstly, I think uh, one of the things we need to have a look at is uh, coal. <clears throat> so the coal gain is not looking super. Uh, that said, it looks a little bit screwy like that because it's 8 o'clock at night. Uh, sorry, no, it's 5 o'clock in the morning. So uh, actually, I think what I'll do is I'll zip it forward so that um so that we actually get to daytime which is i think uh eight o'clock is work time right okay excellent work uh captain so yes yeah, so so i've i've had to heat a lot of things obviously it's minus 60 degrees outside i mean holy heck um that's going to chew through our coal it is going to chew through our coal but we have coal so we have we have 672 coal for a maximum of 2,250. So yeah, okay, um, we could we could do more. I'll talk about that. Um, wood seems to be going fine. Don't have a problem with that. We've got 311, and that's okay. Steel is a bit of a problem. Let's talk about that soon. Food is definitely a problem. Um, the reason it says food ration, that's not raw food, so it doesn't. I've got 136 raw food. You can see down there. I don't know if I can. Can I go down? I, I don't think I can. No, I can't go. It's over on the right-hand side. Anyway, um, the the issue is that these these places aren't working because they're too cold. So we've got raw food, but we're not making any food. And we need to go and have a look at that as well. Uh, Medical-wise, we've got this one outpost, which is which is dragging us down because we can't um we can't treat this because again too cold so there you go and we have uh, a number of people that are quite cold in their tents and quite cold these are freezing out here um so they're like kind of moving out and i don't blame them um it says here we've got no vacant beds in our care homes uh the care house has it says 14 patients out of a possible of 20 so I don't know what that means but we got 18 vacant beds so there's issues so let's talk about some of the issues so the first issue is really uh, steel so I've, I've built another steel works uh, or will be it's under construction <clears throat> it seems like uh, can we only do two you can only place them in uh, certain places so let's have a look at steel uh, so uh, uh, there's two spots here that you could build them and there's nowhere else so I've had a look it doesn't matter you can't put it anywhere else this is as many steelworks as I'm going to be allowed to have of this particular type right so there you go and uh, and, and it's just we're just not going to go any further with those and that's that so that's fine so we have some uh, I guess this is probably we have plenty of workers got 20 available so We've got a room for 10 in there, so we're going to get that staffed up. We're going to start chugging out some more steel, because I do need steel. I need steel for some of my um, better build housing, uh, which is which is what we need. In, in terms of temperature, it is, it is, it is cold, man. It is pro properly cold. This thing is okay, but it's not really doing much, to be honest. I mean... This is this is one heck of a really really cold house, um, but it's just because it's just so cold. But we've got to get through to day 23. But I, I noticed that we've been we've been in this cold snap for a long time, and the warm snap is going to be less is going to be three days. So it's not exactly we're spending an awful lot more time colder than we are warmer. So I think that these things. 
uh, help, but I don't, I don't fully get how. Yeah, I don't, I don't fully get how we can get people to livable. Um, a lot of people are chilly. I don't know why this is livable. I don't, I haven't done anything with it. So I don't know why this is livable, but why this bunkhouse is not. I don't understand the mechanic at play there. So I don't, I don't really know what's, what's going on with that. All of these are just uh, too cold to operate, which which brings me to this problem. So this is the problem with <coughs> with the cookhouses. So the cookhouses aren't working because they're too cold. Man, I can uh, jump back in here and stick this on overdrive, uh, which will briefly boost us with some stuff. But to be honest, um, we just got to make it through the next day, I think, and we will be okay because temperatures will pick up so, so in terms of keeping warm uh, so we've obviously I've built this thing out here and there's homes around here um, and I have a home here and I have a cookhouse here and I have a cookhouse over here and I have a, a hothouse over here now I don't these things don't need to be heated um, it just so happens that people working there stand a greater chance of getting sick while they're working there um, so I guess the issue for me is that while I go around here making sure that we've got enough people working um what i've what i've been thinking of doing is because we we built some homes out here and then we're further further out and we've got this food and thing here what I, and we've got a church here so what i was thinking of doing was i'm gonna uh demolish this and move it over here and i'm gonna demolish this and move it over here and then i'm gonna build some homes around here and if we get enough steel i'm gonna um I'm going to build one of these so that's and and then I'm kind of going to work out here because there's nothing out here there's some trees but we can put a sawmill on the edge somewhere it's quite a big area so we might have to subdivide it but I'm kind of thinking that I'm going to use this as a focus for more homes and food like cooked food and things and, and maybe medical and try we've got a care home here so and churches here so i think with the faith side of things and with the heat side of things and uh with the cooking cookery side of things i can start doing uh buildings out this side um and then i'll worry about fitting in other things like resource gathering things out this side for example because we've got lots of industry and things out here yes we've got the uh, house of prayer out here which is covering a couple of these houses which is fine um, we also got the temple out here but this is covering everything so this side over here if you like this whole third is really going to be uh, resources resource depots we've got like fighting arenas that don't care about heat and stuff like that so we're going to try and focus on housing on this side everything else on this side and we'll kind of move and tweak and, and fiddle with things as and when we need to. And that's sort of um, where my thinking is going with that. Um, in terms of these guys and where they're going, these guys are on their way back. Um, so I don't, it doesn't, it doesn't tell me what they're carrying anymore. So I don't actually know what they're carrying. Um, what have we got here? We've got a temporary settlement. Um, so don't know anything about that. These guys are going off to this long-winded frozen grove. We've got a snow cliff. We've got winter home here. Uh, we've got the coal mine. We've got the wood. So we want to get an outpost because I want to get this coal mine, coal outpost sorted. And I wouldn't mind if there's one of these, either frozen grove or snow cliff, uh, or even this one, maybe, temporary settlement, that turns out to be an outpost for steel because we could do with steel so we've got our scouts off doing things so well, I'm just conscious of stuff 
Regarding the Londoners, um, so I think we can only really wholeheartedly tackle this with these laws. This is the next law, which I've got 18 hours to sort out. This is called public penance. People abandon the Londoners with each use. So it's time late, it's got to cool down. But I think that that's pretty good. Public penance can cause injuries and discontent will rise. Each use lowers discontent. So I think that's where we're going with that one. Um, regarding the other things in relation to hope and stuff, I, don't, I just keep trying to keep people happy, uh, keep people warm. I guess research wise we're moving on to overdrive couplings because um, when I hit overdrive I want it to be better we might need to go to improved heaters in terms of exploration and things I mean I'd like to get the factory done but our main problem is heat at the minute um, resources wise we're doing okay the the steelworks upgrade wouldn't hurt um, because then we'll get steel a little bit quicker which has been a, bit, a little bit of an issue um, if we're going to do a coal outpost probably don't need to worry about coal we seem to be doing okay with wood um, for the food health and shelter thing um, I mean we can get some upgrades to the bunkhouse we can get some upgrades to the hothouse to try and make them work a little bit more um, but at the minute the issue is 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 heat so we, we might have to I think what I want to do is I want to focus on overdrive couplings. I want to focus on maybe um, this doubles it. Man. Uh, uh, no heat zones are going to be extended. Maybe the range, and then so I I need to, I need to get the heat working better. Really, I think is is a short answer. A lot of these need steel, so to get this stuff stored, I need steel. So hence working on steel. Right, so that's where we're at. <laughs> that's where we're at, if that makes any sense to you. Um, so what we're going to do is we're going to progress time a little bit. And they brought in some steel. Excellent news. Right, this is up and running. No, it's not up and running. This is up and running. So we need some clerics. So the faith keepers has been established. Right, okay, thank you. So we've got... Uh some clerics operating which I think is good they probably want to stay warm and we can do that discontent will fall uh, so we can do that uh, we want to check if there's any other stuff we can do we can't do the sermon we can't do the evening prayers some Londoners will be persuaded that's awesome so we're, we've got eight days to sort this out and um, we're at uh, 32. Now then, one of the things I did say I wanted to build was the... I think it's... no, it's tech. One of these. So, where do we build one of these? We built one there, and we said we want to build here. So, we don't need to build in, because I think... If you have a look, the heat zone is out to 2, right? So, we've got inner and outer. So, I think what we want to do is... What I would like to do is I'm going to build a street and the street is going to come around the back to here. Now what I want to do eventually is I want to move this because I want to get the other cookhouse which is here in here. In fact, I'm going to do that now. I'm going to dismantle that building. Let's, let's do this now. Let's... Oh, we got a procession going on. Jolly good. Jolly good. This is the procession to keep the faith. Nice. Nice. Let's convert some of those Londoners, shall we? Jolly good. Jolly good. Some Londoners were denounced and persuaded. Excellent. Excellent. I just want this demolished. I think, honestly... Oh, I got going here. Food for overtime. From now on, emergency ships shifts will cost food and hope will rise. Sure. I don't think I have anybody. But I just, we've got some scouts. So these scouts are waiting. I would like to send them out. So let's grab them. And we'll send them out here to the temporary settlement. It's going to take them a while to get there, but that's okay. Um, 
we can start dismantling this because it's not it's not working anyway we turn that heater off we can dismantle the building um, and I think we can probably do the same for that to be honest we'll turn the heater off and dismantle the building I'm just gonna move these now it just needs to be done um, I think this needs to be there and I think if we put it there it will get all of these buildings that I want so we put that there yeah let's try there and uh, and we'll see how that goes for now uh, I need to staff the steelworks we've got nine workers and one engineer it's all good. Probably needs a heater. Go for it. I think this one's already got a heater on it. Yeah, fine. Um, and while we're at it, food-wise, I'd like another one of these hunters' hangers, which I think is... Are these out here? That's next to the temple. But I think we could put them out here. I mean, we could put it like quite literally behind the one that's right there. Um, all the roads have great big things on the end of them. I mean, I'm okay with that, but... Yeah, I gotta put it there. Let's put it there. Let's put it there. Yeah, all the roads have suddenly got great big crosses on the edges of them, which is, which is okay. And what's this that's having problems? A medical post. We might have to move that as well, or uh, look to build another one of these which costs 20 steel because we have the thing is it's it's in an it's in an awkward place and I don't really want to use that I did say I want how I wanted heating and things out here so we could almost move it so I think I think it maybe it needs moved let's 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 fit what we need to fit in where we need to fit it in and um, and see what's happening in terms of what was that something else is happening girl is asking she's crying I lied I lied I'm sorry I told her my mom said you know, I'll burn hell but I was just mad and please don't punish her her mother will be punished discontent will fall slightly wow that hope rise discontent falls slightly let's go with the hope rising answer I think that's slightly better <laughs> I, d I didn't I didn't like my options on that all right overdrive couplings is sorted so uh, let's see now we'll pause let's go and have a look at the tech tree so heating wise that's what we wanted let's go let's get that done um, the coal is okay oh I wanted to build an outpost remember do you not remember these things <laughs> uh, where is it an outpost. Is it over here in tech? Ah, oh, I need 45. Never mind. How'd you wished? Right, what's this? 15? Oh, that's my hangar. I have nobody available. Ah. Oh. Well, that blows. Um, let's see. Is it better to take people away from that or take people away from something else? This is only operating at 60%. People must be sick. There's 14 engineers. Oh, I see. Right, that can go down. That can go up. I need... Um, I need... Uh, I need 10 workers. There you go. Oh no, 15, don't I? Sorry, how many does it take? 15. Alright, I got 10. Can I get 5 more workers out of here? I can get 4... I think that's oper going to be operating at almost 90% anyway. The coal thumper I kind of need. The gathering post. I've got mainly children working at. But we can probably drop one worker. And add him there because food is important. Uh, that is the faith keepers. Uh, they must, one of them must be sick. Um, right, okay, so I got rid of this here. 
which was, um, what did I call it? A tent. So we put another cookhouse in there, right? And we see there's a hot zone. So I'm going to put a hot house in there. Now, this that takes up a big bit of space, but I don't think I'm going to use it all. I think what I'm going to do is there's a medical tent there, but what I'm going to do is I'm going to build a medical post there. Right? And then that should allow me to also build... No, not a tent. I didn't want a tent. I wanted the bunk house there. And ooh, I could put one there and then um, build in a street. Put one there and one there. I'm thinking about um, what if what if I were to build um, another one of those there. Oh, it won't go in, but it will go there. Because I wanted to... Uh, why want to go in? I want to go in. Because I wanted to... I could line that up with, uh, with that, but it's just too close to that hunter's. What about another cookhouse? That's a little better. And then um, we might be able to put another heater further out and we can build some more housing further out and we can shift some housing that's looking currently cold um, and do that instead and I need a street because the plan is to run a street like all the way over here uh, I guess all the way over there then there then there that might be better right that's a lot of construction um, that's a lot of construction but I think it's I think it's what I need to do. So yeah, so we're gonna let those build in and we're gonna see how we go. Work is over for today. There's time for harvest and time for sleep. Uh why they got no people waiting. Why are they waiting? Where's their people? Resting, going to rest, resting, going to rest. Really? I hope you got some food. Uh, right, under construction, under construction, under construction. Do we have anything with the uh, evening prayers? Yeah, evening prayers on the go. Don't think there's anything else. Right, go, go, go. Nighttime procession is starting. Jolly good. Sorry about that. <sighs> right, what's happening here? The Londoners are stealing again. Yeah, let's get the faith keepers to sort that out. Um, still constructing, still constructing. Nice, the faith keepers succeeded in doing something. Caught red-handed. Ooh, discontent rises if you let the people decide their fate. A person will leave the city forever. You will have three days to sign the public penance law. Did I just have a thing about laws? I think I did, didn't I? Because that was what I was going to do anyway. <laughs> so, ta-da! Public penance. Yeah, I'm going to do that anyway. Public penance. And I did. Has it it has passed. Does it does it come in here? No? Is there where else would it come in? Is this the medical post? Yeah, I haven't finished building these. 
I haven't finished building these because something, because I keep getting distracted. The people regain the numbers of anyone to abandon our city. People are recovering from the witness starting to hope for the future. Yes, jolly good, jolly good. We are winning. Is this about the winning, yeah? We are making the winning. Apparently. Uh, what are they doing? Public penance. The faith keepers have public penance. Great. Public penance is going ahead. Of course. Are these things built yet? Ah, it's getting warmer again. Oh. Things have spread out. That's good. Comfortable. Livable. Comfortable. Can I turn these things down now? And then they'll they'll still be fine. Can I do that from here? A new work day starts I think that that's fine. On. That's on. That's on. That's a church. Uh, that's a cook house. It should be fine. That should be fine. There's some construction going on. Uh, right. Right, let's have a look. More people. Uh, kids. Kids are good at cooking, right? Why not? Or stuff. So, food is working. Medical treatment is part of the drama. We've got a bit of a backlog. Bit of a backlog of medical treatment. Um, are you on? Or off? I'd like you to be off. There we go. So, what's this? This is... A gathering post and a coal thumper. This is the sawmill gathering posts. These are the steelworks. This is the faith keepers who are all good. Good, good, good. This thing is fine. All fine. They're all warm, hunky dory. Super duper fine. Um, medical treatment. What's up with the medical treatment situation? What is this? A cookhouse. More kids. One, two, three, four kids. One worker. Get that working. Uh, steam hub range. Steam hub that heats in the 16th when we're using the 17th. That's virtually twice as much coal. Because I'm kind of conscious we're down on coal. Because <laughs> I don't. Uh, I think here. I can't. No, I can't do that. Um, I don't. I don't see how I can exchange change the ranges uh, because it won't let me get to heat zone 3 even though it says steam hub oh because that's the generator these are steam hubs uh, ah so the range is set at 2 is that right I mean it is right I'm not wrong Heat zone range one, heat zone range two, but it doesn't. What does that do? What about this one? And what does this say? It can work in the morning, or it can work 24 hours. I think it needs to work 24 hours. Um, I'm conscious of our coal balance not being super. Um, so. When do we build this outpost? Uh, where did we say it was? Tech? Outpost. Right. That's... Whoa! That's pretty big! <laughs> I was not expecting that! <laughs> um, I mean, there's some things to expect, and that's not one of them. How in the heck can you wash your neck? Uh, where does it go? It says that it can go there? Or there, but it'll take out... It'll take out some stuff, or it'll go there. Where it'll not take out stuff, but that's okay. Because uh, we need to build a street. Um, let's build a street out. 
and in. Ah, uh, yeah, that's a fairly chunky bit of kit. Um, what was I doing? I was trying to sort something. This says there's not enough raw food. That's because you're working on standard meals. Get on to soup. You're on soup. You are uh, also in need of working on soup. You are in need of people. We only have three engineers for that hot house. So, could we get engineers from somewhere else? This is gathering coal. I kind of need you. This is what? A sawmill? I think we can probably cut back. How many do we need? We got seven. We need three more. What's this? It's just a resource depot. Just a resource depot. This is a sawmill with one automaton. I might... Is this the sawmill? And that's the coal thumper. This is the sawmill. We'll take three more, I think was what I said. Right, and we've got the hot house, then working on generating food. We've got the cook house desperately trying to work on food. Uh, we've got three cook houses. And if we want the... Um, sorry, if we want the steam hub, we need 20 steel. These guys and girls are working on steel. That would eat up some food rations. Yeah, go for it. Right, okay. Um, num, 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 num. What was I going to do? Oh, yes, research. <laughs> This, the generator burns 10% less coal, but I need 20 steel. Ah. Exploration. 20 steel. What's this? Lighter scout sleds. Scouts move faster. Let's do that while we're waiting on the steel to catch up. Um, and let's carry on building the streets. I think you guys are building streets, aren't you? What's this now? A group of amputees, they want to help. Um, what do they want? We can't do that, but if we fashion some civil, we can help in the cookhouse. Um, I can't afford it. It won't let me. But if we fashion some civil prostheses out of wood, we can't afford it. I, I mean, I could afford it. I think the issue is... Well, it doesn't tell me. Maybe, the, maybe they need like 100 wood. I have no idea. Anyway, bit of a bummer. The Londoners is back down to 27. The coal is going back up again, which is jolly jolly good. The food is back up to 276 rations. Oof. Londoners prey on discontent. Ask the number of Londoners will rise slightly. The number of Londoners will rise. Disperse the crowd. Enough of this. Tomfoolery and vagabonderiness, or something. Um, what did I say for this thing? Steam hub. That's right. I wanted to. It's kind of overlapping with that other one, isn't it? I mean, it would be good if it was kind of here, and then I could build these houses out here. Um. What I want to do is I want to have a look at what is the housing situation. The housing situation is that there is... Where is this? We have 18 vacant beds. Where is this tent? That tent? That tent can be dismantled because it's not helping. It sounds like there's a fight going on. These are all fine. This one is also in need of dismantling. So there we go. So I've got rid of those, or we'll be getting rid of those, which I think will be fine. What's this? This is inoperative because... Because why? Why is this inoperative? Because... Too cold. Really? 
why would you be too cold? Is this because this thing is not reaching? Just doesn't reach? What about if I do that one? Will that, will that work for you? It does. That one needed a little bit of an increase. And what's this? This is the medical. Right, I need five people from my medical facility, people, people. That's five engineers. Uh, okay. That's not engineers. Where would I get engineers for rum? That wouldn't be a major drama. That's a coal thumper, so that would be a major drama. I could get five engineers from there. Because wasn't I... Didn't I... Wasn't there a medical? This one. That uh, wasn't really working. So we'll not scrap it for now. But what we will say is we'll put them in there. Because we have 36 people in need of treatment. So maybe we need to... Um, build another um, medical out here and what did we say where we're trying to put this thing we're trying to put it like there aren't we I mean we're trying to put it right kind of there so I wonder if we kind of arguably take a road and try and make it straight there and then we build another medical post right there and then uh, when this road builds in we should be able to build a place to heat uh, <laughs> There's some penance going on. <laughs> right. I mean, I guess it beats public floggings, right? Probably. Um, sorry, I wanted to go... Look at the coal going down again. Blimey, a roly. Right, what's happening here? Wood. Uh... Shallow graves, etc., etc. The corpses have been stripped of edible parts. Yeah, okay. Well, you know. I mean, honestly. Right. Uh, this is the last one out here for now. So let's go and check this out. Uh, we've got those guys heading out to that other place. So that's all good. Um, the coal situation is not looking fantastic. So I honestly think we need another coal thumper. Which is this guy. And we need to get that sorted. Now I did say I was going to put industry out here, didn't I? Or try and find a place for industry out here. You can go there. I don't know how I'm going to staff it. I'm sort of running out of people. Honestly. Right, I think that's done. And this is a medical post. What? I thought I moved five people out of there. And that would mean that I would have five people to put here. Where did they go? Where did those people go to? Did, did you say? Um, this, I think... Let's wind this down. Because... It seems like we've got enough for now. And that's... Let's wind that down. And let us wind the engineers out and wind some people in. And then that means that we could wind in some engineers. And we need to find some more engineers. What's happening here? Um, so we can uh, wind in some kids. Find out some workers, which then means we need to find somewhere. That's the sawmill. We need to find some workers to replace engineers. There, 
Yes, two engineers out. Some workers in. Two engineers in. Uh, heat is tech. And I wanted it to be built literally there. And then that will heat that. I can build medical posts and houses and things on either side of this thing. Um, so we're trying to spread the houses and the cooking and the everything else out this way. Uh, these are currently not working because we seem to have quite a bit of food, but I'm going to keep an eye on it. The steel is going up, but the coal is not. So we very definitely need this extra coal thumper, plus also this outpost that we're building should see us uh, kind of right-ish, I think, right? Okay, let's carry on. How are we doing with the Londoners? We're below 20 now, which is good. What's this? Faith Keepers. Yeah, let's get the Faith Keepers onto it. They seem to know what they're doing. Uh, working on that. The Faith Keepers, I think, are uh, still working on that. So that's all good. The Faith Keepers failed. Well, that's not very good. The faith A Faith Keeper was murdered. We caught one of the thieves, but he's given him a chance to repent. Banish him. Let him go. A number of Londoners will fall. We'll give him a chance to repent then, obviously. I think is the answer to that. This one. Uh, let's check the medical. 36 untreated. It's not... It's not... What's the one's that? That's that one. But we'll just, it says because it's cold. Which is, which is fine. We're trying to get this thing built. I don't know how to make it built faster. <laughs> they're, they're on their way! People abandon the Londoners. We're down to 12. What's happening? Several of the people who wanted to flee have descended to trust. Convinced that there's hope. Of course there is. I'm a genius. Stable genius, me. Um... The generator is shutting down. Oh no, that's not good. We ran out of coal. Uh, that that could be a problem. That could could be a relatively no. The coal's back on the up again. Uh, right. Okay. We've got this additional coal thumper, and we've got one person to staff it. Who who who? Um, the sawmill we've used up a lot. We might. Oof. Right. We need to find people. We're short of people, man. Gathering posts we kind of need for coal. We've got kids, so we can drop two of those and add two of those, which means that we can add two of those. Anywhere else, we have no more people available. What's this? The research is slowing down because we have. Uh, no, I'm going to drop one there and pull in an engineer. That's four. What's this? Gathering post. I've got that staffed as much as I can. The coal thumper I've got staffed as much as I can. This is an automaton doing its thing. <coughs> Fire up sermon. Um, I've even taken people off the cookhouses. If that one's working, it did I, 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 I deleted I deleted it over there, didn't I? I very definitely did. Um, do you think maybe drop a couple or three there? That's seven. Uh, let's let's try seven, and we've got some people. Where are they? Over here. Wood and steam cores. That's fine. May God forgive the genius who sacrificed human lives in the name of progress. Exiles of Tesla City. Okay, the walled colony in the Dreadnought Landing. That is the walled colony. And that is the Dreadnought Landing. 18 hours, 16 hours. I'm not in a desperate hurry for wood. What do you think, walled colony? Dreadnought Landing. Send them out to the wall colony. 
And they're still on their way to wherever they're on their way to, which is fine. <clears throat> so, hmm, the, um... I think we're going okay with the generator. It's it's cranking back up again ever so slowly. Um, cranking, cranking ever so slowly. Cool game. Yes, of course it is, because you're telling me that the generator has shut down. Um, and I need to switch it on. That's why the call was not going, um, not going so thing. Um, what do we not need to heat? Are we heating anything that we need to heat? What's this? Faith Keepers? No, they were off. Um, I think they were, I think everybody's off. I've reduced all the heat. These things might be expensive. Um, this one is... Let's reduce the time. Um... I know that it's going to cause dramas, but we need to preserve some uh, coal. So if that goes there, that's fine. Um, everybody's feeling the pinch. Inoperative. No, that's just, let's run it again. Yeah, okay. That's better. That's, that's better. We're, we're operating a little bit better. And we need some more research. So, what were we looking for in heating? Generator efficiency. To burn less coal. Absolutely. There we go. Um, Londoners. 12. Six days remaining. Uh, have we got this outpost built yet? At least 10 citizens. 40 wood. Right. So, we're ready to go with the outposts. We still don't have a steel outpost, but we do have a coal outpost, which is probably our biggest thing right now. But we really need 10 citizens and we need wood. And we don't really have a lot of spare citizens, as you can see. 135 workers, 73 engineers, 26 kids. We got an awful lot of amputees. So I've got to say, I, I think really we've got to get this factory built. Um, because um, we're probably going to be quite reliant on them. Um, let's have a ceremonial service. Um, because we're, we're going to need we're going to need some additional people. So we need after we get this. Uh, sorry, research. After we get the heating done, if we go to uh, I think it's exploration and industry this then this will I mean we still need to research it I think now this is streamlined streamlined and integration there'll be some basics here automatons and highly advanced devices can be produced I think this will enable us to do some basic prosthetics so once we've sorted the heating uh, we need to sort the prosthetics on top of dealing with these Londoners but I think where we are with the Londoners is we're nearly there. We've got uh, this, which looks marvelous. This is Protectors of the Truth. The captain assumes the title of Protector of the Truth. He can tell us what is right and what is wrong and so guide our faith. Oh, Mormons, eh? Um, each use greatly reduces discontent, but discontent will rise as a result of the law. And then you've got this thing, which is, I don't know. But there you go. So we'll do that then, obviously. Um, I don't see shrines, field kitchens, and houses of healing adding an awful lot. So very shortly we'll be moving into Protector of the Truth, which will very definitely give us quite a lot of sway, sir. I am here by divine right. Or something. So, yeah. So that's it, that's it, and um, that's where I'm going to call it on this one. Oof, it's all very exciting stuff, very, very exciting stuff. Um, but we are making an awful lot of progress, we are making an awful lot of progress, and we are getting there, we are getting there, we are getting there, I feel. <laughs> I could be wrong. Um, presumably this Londoner crisis, um, once it's quelled, will go away, 
but then there'll be another crisis. I, I noticed that I have we haven't found anywhere that progresses the story, so I'm assuming something changes after the end of the Londoner crisis, and that's what progresses the story, or something like that. Um, we really need to get more people, and we've got an awful lot of amputees, so we really need to get those prosthetics developed. And the only other thing I'd say is, look at that uh, temperature thing. So, uh, it's these hot and cold snaps, they must come randomly, because um, we're going to have a cold, and then it's only going to last for a day, and then we're going to have a warm. So, I guess we're getting the hang of laying out the place a little bit better. We're moving some things around to ensure people stay warmer. Um, we're trying to change where the cities are and everything else. We've got five steam cores, which is fine. Um, we probably just need a slightly more reliable coal resource. And we're sort of pushing it at the edge of the development envelope at this stage. I think we really need to get the outpost built. We're getting another coal thumper, but we probably need to move into some additional research. We're going to reduce the inefficiency, which will help. Um, food is good, which is not bad. A medical is not great. Um, we're trying to catch up on that. Um, trying to catch up on that, trying to catch up on that. There's only one medical outpost not working. But really, honestly... Um, we, we could do with more medical outposts and we could do with um, we could do with getting those to work this is just not gonna work so we're gonna dismantle that building and we're gonna build a new medical building probably at least one new medical building right there and um, if we even, we, you know, we can't build any more because we're out of wood and then we're gonna figure out how to staff it hmm so there you go progress progress and contentment i think certainly the religious order is um, is making its its mark very clearly felt it's exciting it's good it's very it's it's a very good game um, i'm loving it so far i hope you are too if you are drop a like if you want to see more please subscribe if you have any comments or questions or clarifications or tips or tricks of your own if you're thinking of getting it if you are playing it let me know post your comments and i will see you all again real real soon Ta -ta. PlayStation.